This is just what I wanted. Is it? Yes, yes. Well, I don't want luxury, Mr. Rigsby. Just to uh, live simply. Yes, yes, you can't study surrounded by luxury. It weakens you, yes, yes. You don't want a carpet with a thick pile. Yes, tie yourself out crossing the room. Yes. Yes, same with a bed. You don't want a spring interior. Bad for the posture. Oh, yes, yes. Was it uh, theology you said you were studying? That's right, yes. Yes, theology. well, there you are. None of the saints had spring interiors. No, no. They never got out their pits in the morning. <laughs> no, if it's simplicity you're looking for, you come to the right place. Good, yes, good. Yes. How simple did you want it? I could get rid of these chairs. No, 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 no. This will be fine. Thank right, you. right. We'll have to be two weeks to rent over. Four weeks rent in advance. Uh, yes. Uh, can I see the college from here, Mr. Yes, of course, of course, of course, yes. There you are. Now, you see that dignified grey building there with the arched windows yeah. and the uh, the light glinting on the coloured glass, giving off a sort of myriad of light. Yeah. Is that the college? Uh, yeah. No, that's the abattoir. Oh. No, no. <laughs> no, the college is just behind it, just a stone. Oh, so, yes, 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 yes. If you hear the occasional bang, don't worry, that's the humane killer. <laughs> it's all right, it's at the abattoir, not the college. Oh, okay. <laughs> Mind you, some of us think it should be the other way around. <laughs> You'll have to watch your step down there, they're never off the cannabis. Ah. Artificial stimulants. Oh, what? Yes. What we need today, you know, Mr. Rigsby, is a fresh moral attitude. Oh, my very words. I was only saying the other day in the bookies, what we need is a fresh moral attitude. <laughs> yes, and, yes, four weeks' rent, I think I said in advance, wasn't it? Oh, oh the good book. Yes, yes. Well, you can't go far wrong with that. Yes. My constant companion during the war. That's on a deck of cards. Yes. yes. Oh, I can see that I've come to the right house, Mr. Rigsby. Yes, yes. There are some people, you know, who would have derided me for carrying them. But I look upon it as a challenge, a chance to work with young minds, to grow with them, to find the path of truth together. Mm. You're Welsh, aren't you? Well, does it show? Just a touch, yes. <laughs> Not a lot of people would have spotted it, but I was in the forces, you see, you get an ear for dialect. Yes, oh, yes. Yes. yes, the minute you walk through that front door, I thought, oh, that is Welsh. Mm. Then I thought, no, I'll take a chance, because, I mean, you're not all like Clive Jenkins, are you? Uh, no. <laughs> no. But I... <laughs> I suppose you'll miss it, eh, Taffy? The, mm. uh, the male voice choir, the welcome in the hillside, the slag heaps, eh? Uh, the <laughs> name is Gwyn. Uh, Gwyn Williams. Right, Lynn, right. Uh, no, Gwyn. Yes, that's what I said. Yes, 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 yes. I suppose I shall miss it, you know. I hadn't actually thought about well, it. Well, never mind. If you get home, see if they've got a Welsh collie down number 12. Perhaps they'll let you take it for more. <laughs> Are there any rules, Mr. Uh, Lee? Just the one. Four weeks' rent in advance. It's the only thing I've seen. Not that the rules worry me, you understand. No. I belong to the primitive church of First Day Witness. Oh. We're very strict, you know. We do not tolerate drinking, gambling, smoking, bawdiness, or fornication. Oh. Are there many of you? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Surprised. Uh, you're a bit old for university, aren't you? Well, we're a very small congregation, Mr. Rigsby. It took an awful long time to collect the money, yes. Mm. Even now they're disappointed, you know. They wanted to send me further. Mm. Some wanted to send me abroad. They said distance was no object. Yes, yes. Well, I can see we're going to get on very well, as long as you respect Miss Jones, of course. Uh, Miss Jones? Yes, yes, has the floor below. Woman of refinement. Very close personal friend of mine, but I'm not rushing it. All right with you? <laughs> I think I can say with my hand on my heart, Mr. Rigsby, that I've always had the greatest of respect for women. Go, okay, let me have the rent. I'll be off then, yes. <laughs> oh, yes, it's in the other... Yes, room. right, right. Uh, ah. Uh, what's this other bed here for, Mr. Uh, which which bed? Oh, that bed, yes. Ah, uh, that bed. That, that's the that's the bed for the black for the uh, that's the uh, that's the bed for your for your room, mate. Yes. Oh. I didn't know I'd have to share. Oh, yes, got to share. Yes. yes. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Oh, yes. Rigsby. Yes, I well, shall have to find wait someone a minute. else. Don't be silly. Come on, don't be hasty. You like him? Mm -hmm. He's the son of a chief. Chief? <laughs> uh, royalty. Ah. Yeah. You mean uh, like the Prince of Wales? Uh, Yes, sort of, yes. I think you see, I've, I've got a very good reason for wanting you to stay. I'm very worried about him. He's been on the slide, has been for some time. You mean he's lost faith? I don't think he ever had it. <laughs> I'm, I'm really very... You see, he's never had your advantages. You're not his fault. You know, he needs someone like you to look up to a man of principle so you could be the making of him. Yes, I think I shall look upon this as a challenge. Ah. You're quite sure now that he needs saving. Oh, Degenerate. He's really plumbed the depths. Yes, mm -hmm. real little Dorian Gray. Yeah, yeah. What about Dorian Black? I suppose. Yeah. I suppose I should never turn my back on someone who needs help. Oh, I wouldn't turn your back on him at all. Oh. No, I think he's been lonely up here on his own. You see, mm -hmm. I'm very, very worried about him. I pray for him constantly, but I don't think I'm getting through. Mm -hmm. I, I didn't know that you were a religious man. Mr. Oh Lee. yes, yes, yes. Uh, yes. I try as often as I can. I don't get down to the church as often as I would like, but that's because of the leg. You see, old war wound. I can't. 
get into the pews, you see, yes, but I never miss thought for the day. Mr. Rigsby, yes. I shall stay. Ah, good. Let me have the four weeks' rent. I'll be off. Yes. Oh, no, Rigsby. Yes. Ah, ah, hello. For now, I can explain. Now, you now, said that when Alan left, I could have the no, room to myself. Don't be silly. You like him. This is Gwen. Now, be careful, because he's very fussy about his name. <laughs> the, the name is Gwen. <laughs> See what I mean? Straight away. <laughs> Come on, Phil. Shake hands. I'm not shaking Calm hands. hands. Philip, shake no, hands. you tried this once too often. The room is too small. It is. Just getting used to a supply of oxygen. He's going to come along and use up all the air. Of course, he yes, and he's not a heavy breather. Look at him, you can tell. He looks like a heavy breather to me. He looks no. as if he snores. Of course, you don't snore, do you, Gwen? Uh, no. No, he doesn't snore. There you are. What's this? A Bible? That's the last straw. He won't like it. What about me? I won't stand for now, it. Look, I'm going to complain. I'll go to the town hall. Now, now you get away from them. Mr. Rigsby. Mr. Rigsby. Yes, yes. Um, Do you think perhaps I ought to leave? No, he likes you. He likes you. Yes, but I, 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 I didn't know that he was... Uh, didn't know he was what? Black. Black? Black, of course. He's black. He comes from Africa. <laughs> what colour do you expect him to be? Sky blue? <laughs> this alters things. Oh, oh, it's a, oh, oh, dear. It's just as well the missionaries didn't take that point of view. They didn't say, oh, blimey, the black let's get the next boat back home, did they? No, they stayed. Even when they were in danger of having their heads stuck on a pole. No, 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 no you, you don't understand. I, I don't want him to feel that I've been patronising him. Don't Besides, he, he might not even want to be saved. Of course he wants to be saved. A good practice for you, Glenn. Gwen. 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 <laughs> well, I think perhaps... <laughs> Maybe I'd better Now, stay. that's yes, better. I must not be faint That's ah. it. You <laughs> yeah, got the gleam back in your eye again now. Oh, yes, yeah, you look I? just like Billy Graham as you said that. Right, <laughs> right, sure, sure. Right, I can do for now. Oh, there's only one thing, Gwim. Oh, what's that? If he starts playing his bongos, watch out. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Ah, Miss Jones, there you are. Miss Jones, I was wondering if you cared to come down for a spot of something to eat this evening. Oh, It's Wednesday, you're usually a bit thoracic. Yes. I thought I'd uh, send out uh, for some cod and a bag of chips. What do you say? Well, Perhaps um... wash down with a glass of chilled white wine? Oh. On a Wednesday, well. Mr. Rigsby, this is a luxury. Well, I've had a bit of a windfall, Miss Jones. Yes. I thought I'd cast my bread upon the waters. Don't you mean <laughs> cod, Mr. Rigsby? <laughs> oh, very, very good. Oh, I, I, you are in sparkling form this evening. <laughs> the ideal dinner companion. <laughs> well, I must confess the cupboard is rather bare. Yes, yes, Mr. Rigsby, yes. I thought of applying a blow lamp to these fish fingers, oh. but in view of your kind of... Replace them in the pack, Miss yes. Jones. We'll enjoy the real thing. It's a privilege. If I can help somebody as I pass along, oh, then my living has not been... <laughs> <laughs> oh, should we ask Philip, Mr. Rigsby? Uh, uh, no, 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 that's all, no. I don't think he's a... No, I don't think he's a fish eater. Oh. Well, certainly not cod, anyway. No, no. Perhaps the odd piranha. <laughs> no, I think he's more used to fish with two sets of teeth. Mm. Yes, I think he'd find cod a bit boring. But well, what about the new tenant, Mr. Rigsby? Mm. Although he does seem a little strange. Really? I heard him singing hymns in the bathroom. Ah, no, that's because the bolt's gone on the door again. That's all I'm doing. <laughs> no, he's a, oh, he's a very nice man. Oh, no, you'll really like him. Yes, yes, very clean living, studying theology. Oh, oh you'll really yes. like him. Well, yes. perhaps we should ask him then. Uh, no, I don't think so, Mr. I think he'd prefer to spend his first evening here in quiet meditation, yes. yes. They, they like to live simply, these monkish types. They don't go in for fish songs. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes. Have you done anything about that mad Welshman? Oh, yet? not again. What's well, the matter I, with you, Phil? I've this religious fanatic in my room. Religious just because he's, just because he reads the Bible. He's oh. not just making him a religious fanatic. He's been singing hymns. Well, well, what about it? It'll do you good. He's an example to us all. He doesn't drink, smoke, swear, or indulge in carnal practice. I, like I don't know why. We've got nothing in common. She, well, she, they do say opposites attract. Thank you, Miss. Really? <laughs> you like him? You share with him. Ah, uh, oh, well, that's. Uh, that's uh, and I'll excuse you, Miss Jones and I are going to partake of a fish supper this evening. I better get the wine in the fridge. Oh, the friend we have. Hey, yeah, you better get up there. Well, it's time for the evening song. <laughs> what are you doing? Nothing. <clears throat> have you dropped something? No. <laughs> oh, no, you're not going to do that every night, are you? Why not? I mean, surely you don't mind my praying. Can't you do it in bed? It's not the same in bed. But somebody's going to see you. Look, I want them to see me. I mean, what is the point in bearing witness if no one notices? Well, I hope you're not doing it for me, and you can keep away with that Bible. You're not doing any missionary work round here. Didn't you uh, like the missionaries then? On the contrary, I always found them delicious. <laughs> you see, you're wasting your time with me. Yes, I know. What? Well, Rigsby told me. Look, he's very worried about you, Philip. He feels that you've you've fallen by the wayside. But never mind. Me? Brother. Fallen? Look, you've got it all wrong. Look, sit down. Sit down. Look, he's the one who needs help. He's too proud to ask. You see, it's Brother Rigsby who's fallen by the wayside. Do you think so? What you've been listening to is a cry for help. 
He's transgressed. Yes, yes. I must say, you did have a, a bit of a wild look around the eyes. A soul in torment, mm. racked by conscience. Are you sure? Do you know what he's up to at this moment? No. Trying to seduce Miss Jones over fish and cheap white wine. <laughs> and when she's under the influence... You mean she's in moral danger? With any luck, yes. <laughs> Even now it may be too late. Yes, but I mean, what can we do? I can't do anything. He won't listen to me. But you, he may listen to you. Yeah. Yes, he might. Perhaps you've been sent here. Mm. Perhaps you're the one to save him from himself. Do you hear the call, brother? Yeah. Yes, I think I do. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hallelujah, brother. Hallelujah. <laughs> Have another glass of wine, Miss Jones. Do you think I should? Yes, it'll remove the flavor of the salt and vinegar. I must say, that was really delicious, Mr. Yes, Eastman. yes, you have to know where to go to get a piece of cod like that, Miss Jones. Oh, yes, yes. It's a very high-class establishment. And did you notice they always give you those little wooden forks? Oh, yes, yes. Very hygienic, too. I mean, look what happened when they found that glass eye in the batter. Glass eye? Yes. Yeah. I mean, they didn't try to blur the issue by making out it belonged to a killer whale, did they? No, no, no. They drained the vats and gave everybody their money back. Oh, you all right, Miss Jones? You've got a little pale. I don't think I will have any more wine. Oh, Thank you, Mr. Oh, come Richmond. along, Miss Jones. There's plenty more where that came from, as they say. <laughs> Shall we wash up, Mr. No, Richmond? no, no, no. We'll stack, Miss Jones. I'm not having those beautiful hands plunged into detergent, Miss Jones. It would be a crime. I must say, Mr. Rixby, we have a silver tongue this evening. Oh, you inspire me, Miss Jones. Would you like to dispose of yourself over here? Yes. Would you bring your glass, Miss Jones? Yeah. Yes. We let Vienna take the rough off the plate. Here's a little marble of getting the tomato sauce out of the cracks. <laughs> and if you have no objection, Miss Jones, I will, uh, I will sit adjacent. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. Do you mind, Miss Jones, if I uh, smoke a cigar? I always think it sets a seal on a meal. Oh, yes, Mr. Rigsby, I love a cigar. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Jones, I've only got the one. <laughs> I love the fragrance. Oh, I see. Good, good, good. Yes. My word, that's a big one. <laughs> Very high class quality, this, Miss Jones. Hand rolled. Oh, yeah. And you say you, uh, you enjoyed the dinner, Miss Jones? Oh, yes, Mr. Rigsby. I don't think you could have got better fish anywhere. I know you can get fish a lot better than that, Miss Jones. Oh, where? Yarmouth. <laughs> Yarmouth? Isn't that rather a long way to go? Not for the weekend, Miss Jones. Mr. Rigsby, you're not suggesting... You get my drift, Miss Jones. Do you mean a double room, Mr. Rigsby? It would simplify the booking arrangements. But you're a married man, Oh, Mr. in name Rigsby. only, Miss Jones. But in the eyes of the church... Oh, forget the church, Mr. Miss Jones. Mr. Rigsby, how can you say that? Didn't the vicar ask you to love, honour and cherish? It was all very well for him. He didn't have to live with it, did he? Come on, Miss Jones, what do you say? Come on, we're not getting any younger. Let us gather our rosebuds while we may. Rosebuds? I don't think it's rosebuds oh, you have in mind, Mr. Rigsby. come on, Miss Jones, let it all hang out. What do you say? <laughs> Mr. Rigsby, you're talking wildly. Stop looking at me like that. I what, Miss Jones? So... so passionately. Well, it's how I feel, Miss Jones. Well, you shouldn't. I must say, you can be very plausible sometimes, very persuasive, Mr. Rigsby. <laughs> I don't know if it's the light, but you look strangely fascinating this evening. Have another glass of wine. Yes, Mr. Rigsby. No, 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 I don't think I should. Come on, Miss Jones, just a drop. It won't do anybody. <laughs> Mr. Rigsby! What is it? I'm Mr. getting wet. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Awfully sorry, Miss Jones. Oh, oh dear, oh. dear, it's a... Oh, I'm sorry. I can't do that. I'll get another bottle, Miss Jones. I'm wet enough, Mr. Rigsby. Oh, no, no, I didn't mean that. You stay there, I'll be back in the jiffy. Have a puff at my cigar if you oh. like. Oh. Repel! Oh, no. ah. oh uh, uh, my name's Quinn, uh, Quinn Williams. I, I've only just arrived. I, I thought perhaps I'd better introduce myself. Yes, I've heard so much about you. Please come in. Ah. I'm Ruth Jones. How do you do? Won't you sit down? Oh, thank you very much indeed. Yes, I hope I'm not intruding. No, 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 not at all. <laughs> <sighs> Is there a... is there a strong smell of drink? Well, yes, I'm sorry, I spilt some. Uh, the bottle is empty. Mr. Yes, well, we've got another one coming. Shall I get you a glass? <laughs> not for me, Miss Joan. <laughs> Look not upon the wine when it is red, for it biteth like a serpent and stingeth like an adder. Well, it's white, actually. The colour is irrelevant, Miss Joan. Oh, I see. I regard that as the devil's brew. Oh, no, I don't think so. Mr. Rigsby gets it from the supermarket. <laughs> I'm sure it's all right in moderation. Is it, Miss Jones? Is it? Yes. I remember those words that I heard when I was a boy. Yes. 
I stand outside the tavern door. Dad's in there upon the floor. <laughs> life would be grand, life would be sweet if he were here upon his feet. It's catchy, isn't it? That's the effect of strong drink, Miss Jones. Yes. It turns decent men and women into monsters. Oh. The clear eye becomes bloodshot. A harsh note creeps into the laughter. The brain cells diminish and the liver. I'm sorry, the liver? Like the sole of an old boot, Miss Jones. Oh. I have seen livers that look as though they've been beaten to death with a stick. Oh, good heavens. But we were only having a fish supper. A fish supper now. But where is it going to lead? Yarmouth. <laughs> Pardon? Well, he asked me to go to Yarmouth with him. <coughs> yes, and of course, you refused. Uh, well, not in so many words. Miss mm. Jones, you cannot go to Yarmouth. No. It's not worth it, Miss Jones. No. It's a downhill path. Yes, you're right. <laughs> Tell me, do your eyes always shine like that when you're being eloquent? Miss Jones. Please call me Ruth. Ruth. Yes. Yeah. A beautiful name, Ruth. Thank you. A biblical name, you know. Yes, indeed. A handmaiden of the Lord who gathered in the gleanings of the field. Oh, God, that's beautiful. <laughs> you Welsh have such a way with words. Yeah. Of course, my name's Jones. I often wonder if I have Welsh connections. <laughs> Look you now. Now, we should have the cork out of this one, Miss Jones. Oh, I'm sorry, this is a private party, Gwen. I'm sorry, Mr. Riggs, but the party's over. Thank you, pardon, Miss Jones. And you can forget the wine. What about Yarmouth, Miss Jones? You can forget Yarmouth, too. But, Miss Jones, what have you been saying to her, eh? She was all right when I left. What I to have her? persuaded her to see the light. See the what? I've saved her from a lifetime of regret. And you from that place of unceasing turmoil. What are you talking about? You've never even been to Yarmouth. <laughs> I am not talking about Yarmouth. I am talking about the bottomless pit. Oh, God, you're not offering that again, are Where you? the worm oh, okay, dieth not, oh. and the flame is not quenched, oh, and there is a whale in an unnashing oh, 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 in a lake of fire and brimstone. <laughs> One day, Mr. Rigsby, oh. you may hear the voice of the Lord. <laughs> He has spoken! It's not true, is it, about H.E.L.? Oh, yes! And about the, the cursing and the, and, the, and, the, yes. and, the, and the screaming and the little devils poking you with the fork yes. and the burning flesh. Mm. But I've got nothing to worry about. I like well, I mean, I've, I've led a good life. Well, a fair, fairly good. Uh, well, it's not been too... Well, it's, uh, <laughs> oh, God, oh, no! You're not a religious <laughs> man, are you? Not not me, but I have good news <laughs> Yes, yes. There is still time. Oh, good. Shall we ask him? Do you mean G.O.D.? <laughs> yes. Now? Yes. Pray. Of course. What about my leg, though? Forget, Forget the leg! The leg. <laughs> Open up your heart. Yeah. Hope it doesn't disturb the shrapnel. Hallelujah. Yes, hallelujah. Yes. Lord. Lord, have we started? Yes. <laughs> Lord. Lord. This. Oh, no, no, it's my eyes. Okay. If it goes. <laughs> Lord. This is Riggs. Riggs, be Lord. <laughs> I know he's not much to look not at. Not very good looking, though. No. <laughs> and he's been a miserable not sinner. Not very good at all. Very, very good. He has gambled, he yes. used strong language, drunk to excess, and lusted after the pleasures of the flesh. <laughs> Is there anything else? He'll be going home with, won't he? Believe <laughs> we are finishing from Woolworths till later, can't we? Lord, Lord, he asks for your forgiveness. For your forgiveness, Lord. He wants to begin again. To begin again. And with your help, uh, make a fresh start. Mm. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> wasn't, wasn't too bad, was it? Hey, nothing oh, serious. you feel really? Yes, yes, I feel, yes, I feel, yes. Thank you. I feel like a new man. Thank you very much. What a friend we have in Jesus. <laughs> All our sins and grief to share. What a privilege to come. serenading with those jungle rhythms at the moment. Thank you very much. Shall I get you the morning service? Then? No, I'm reading. Ah, well, no, you shouldn't be reading that on a Sunday. You should be reading religious matters. I am doing. 
Vicar and choir mistress found in Skegness. Mm, that's enough of that. Come on. Not having any more. This, I'm cancelling this paper. You can make do with the war cry from now on. Look, just because you've got religion, it doesn't mean I have to behave like a monk. I can't smoke, I can't drink, I can't read the Sunday papers. It's all his fault. It's time he went. He's a fanatic. Of course, he's not. Just because he's a little religious, he's just against all temptations of the flesh, that's all. He's against it rather a lot, if you ask me. What do you mean? What about all that time he spends with Miss Jones? The Bible reading. Nothing wrong with that. What about all that begatting? Begatting? Begatting. <laughs> There's a lot of begatting in the Bible reads, Why, Why, you che... No, 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 no. I shall turn the other cheek. No, no, I shall forgive you for that remark, brother. You don't believe me? Not at all, no. All right. Huh? Come on. What? I'll show you what sort of Bible reading they're doing. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> what can I help you with today, Ruth? Well, there is one passage I'd like to read to you. Of course. <clears throat> I sat down under his shadow with great delight, and his fruits were sweet to my taste. Mm. I can explain that. No, I haven't finished. <laughs> he took me to the banqueting hall, and his banner over me was love. Stay me with flagons, comfort me with apples, for I am sick of love. Uh, uh, Ruth, his I... left hand is under my head, and his right doth embrace me. Uh, Ruth, I can explain this, yes. you see. They're, they're comparing physical love with spiritual love, you yes. see. Solomon replies by saying, Thy lips are like a thread of scarlet. Yes. Thy speech is comely. Oh, yes. And thy temples are like pomegranate. Go on. Mm. Thy neck is like the Tower of David. Yes. And thy... Thy... Yes, yes. <laughs> Thy breasts, breasts yes. are like two young doors oh. that are twins and feed upon the rushes. Oh, yes, yes. Yes. No, it's Jones! Get off me! You, you scarlet woman! Jezebel! I cannot stay in this den of iniquity! Well, get out, get it! <laughs> It's all in there. Yes, yes, but I miss Jones. Yes. Thy lips are like scarlet Mr. runners. Thy throat is like a pomegranate. Oh, Miss Jones, thy knockers are like something else. <laughs>